Hey there, old sport. What you got there? A new iPhone? I hear those things break pretty easily when you drop them. Do you have a protection plan? You say no? Those things are for losers? Aren't you worried about dropping it? What you doing there? Checking your Facebook account? I bet you have lots of new messages from all your friends, right? Only kidding. Oh, you do? What's that you say? You're quite the ladies' man? I'll take your word for it. Oh no, what did you just do? Did you just drop your new iPhone? You silly boy, I warned you about that. Oh dear. Looks like someone cracked their screen. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, but how would you like a new phone? And there you are, a new shitty phone. I hope you enjoy it, it actually works. You can even throw it across the room without it breaking, go ahead, try. That a boy. It's still in working condition, hooray! Good job. Hey, what's up? As you can tell, it's another unboxing video, but this time it's a little more cellular. <laughs> Joke of the day. But this is a iPhone 4S, the 16 gigabyte version, the one that retails for $199 with a two year plan. Um, it comes with the iPhone itself, um, the earphones, um, the connector, and the USB charger, the wall charger that you plug in. So um, Verizon's my carrier, and uh, this is my first smartphone that I got. Um, this is the first one, so it's kind of a big deal for me, you know. Got the data plan and everything, you know, the two gigs of data, um, you know, wireless 3G internet, you know. It's good stuff, finally, you know. I guess I, I finally jumped on board, you know. I It was a difficult decision picking this, because they have other like Android phones that are 4G, but 4G is, is spotty here sometimes, and it doesn't even have it where I go to school, so I just I wouldn't even bother with with it right now. And I know iPhones are really reliable and they're solid, and they have pretty good battery life, and they're supported really well with the apps and everything. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna open this up. I mean, of course. Of course, I've already opened it up, but I haven't like like opened up anything else besides the phone part. Um, I activated it. Of course, it looks very nice. Um, it's got the um, like the vibrating like sound button on the side that you can flip on and off, and it's got the volume control, the little plus minus things that you can use, and it's got the power button. It's got that main button that you press. Um, it comes with a camera too. It's made of glass on both sides and it's metal right here and that's why it really shatters really easily if you drop it. But it's a really cool phone. I got a nice case for it um, that I'll show in a second. I already put the screen protector on. I'm, I'm showing it without the case right now just, just to see what it looks like and stuff. But this is kind of what the front of the case looks like. It says iPhone 4S on the side. It's got the Apple logo. It also has iCloud. You know, you can sync your stuff wirelessly to your computer and everything like that. Um, but let's look at all the other goodies inside. Designed by Apple in California. Um, this is a little information booklet. Comes with all your little nifty gifties. Fingertips. That's what she said. <laughs> um, of course, you get little stickers that I never use. iPhone 4S, you know, it's basically made out of toilet paper, one ply. Um, just a bunch of technical jargon. Nothing you need to really read unless you're extremely bored. This is a little more interesting, though. It's like a little accordion style pamphlet. It talks about camera photos, video, sound controls, web. Um, maps, create folders, Apple Store, iTunes Store, um, iCloud, and just a lot of other shit. 
FaceTime messages, intelligent keyboard, cut and paste notifications. Surrey. Surrey is new to the iPhone 4S. Um, it wasn't available in the iPhone 4 model. Um, <laughs> Surrey's pretty funny. Um, it's a little spotty sometimes if you ask it something. Sometimes it will recognize it. Sometimes it will think it's another word. Sometimes it doesn't even help out at all to ask Surrey anything. So, But it's a cool feature nonetheless. Um, you can like ask it to like play music like Surrey play sound like play I don't know Muse that's one of my favorite bands um, but of course it comes with a little wall charger now this is a lot different than the wall charger that I bought a couple years ago this one's like a lot more smaller and compact the other one was like huge kind of look like almost like the the MacBook charger um, comes with the typical USB cords I have about five of these now um, but I'm actually excited to get these headphones because this one has a little microphone in it and it's got the little volume controls it on it that's, that you can press but I actually like Apple headphones um, they've been good to me they usually last about two years before they break typically for me because um, I've owned um, you know video iPods before. I mean, this is the first generation iPod video. This this one was originally my brother's that he got like, I guess, seven months, or seven years ago this November that they came out. It's a long time ago, but this one's still working fine. The one that I got, this black one broke. I mean, it didn't break, it just like, it wouldn't sync up to the computer anymore, and you couldn't put anything on it anymore, so it's basically useless, but this one's still fine after seven years, basically. So, they're pretty solid products all around. Um, this one, I've, I've listened to music with it so far. I've downloaded a couple apps, like Pandora. Um, they work great. I have Wi-Fi here, so I can just listen to that. And it's a really fun thing to do. Um, texting is very smooth with the keyboard. Um, you just slide to unlock, and you talk to people. And you can either talk like that, you can turn it sideways. I mean, basic stuff for iPhone stuff, you know. I mean, it's not that complicated, especially if you have a smartphone before. Um, but definitely a lot of cool things on here, like the Facebook app. Um, and of course, you have, like, these free games, like, and all these, like, $1 ones, like Fruit Ninja and Angry Birds and whatever. And, but there's pretty much an app for anything, as you already know, basically. Um, but it's really nice to have everything in like this one little neat little package. Um, these phones are really great, except the durability may be, may be a little bit of an issue because, as you already know, if you drop it, you're kind of fucked unless you have like a friggin' case on it or something. But it's a great phone. Uh, I, haven't, I haven't tried FaceTime yet on it. Um, but I'm sure it's fine. I've taken some cameras so far, or pictures so far, I mean, and the camera is very nice. It's very crisp. It has, um, it has a great, like, retina display on it, too. Um, just everything looks bright and really awesome. The screen, it's gorgeous. Uh, it's also got the front ca camera, so you can take pictures of yourself if you're that self-conceited. Um, I've had it for a couple days so far right now, but um, I'm really liking it so far. I'm glad I switched over from a regular phone. My other phone that I had was this one. It's an Alias 2. Um, I've had this one for about two years, a little more than that. But it's this is my this is my baby. She's a brick. I've dropped her so many times. She's 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 rugged and worn. I love her though. But it was time to move on to a new refined beauty. But, uh, let's see, is there anything else I wanted to talk about? Hmm. I'm going to talk about some of the basic features. Texting, I already talked about that. It's got a calendar in it. Um, photos, I already talked about the camera. Videos, you know, it takes good videos too. You can go on YouTube, look, uh, do maps, get weather updates, take notes, reminders, alarm clock, regular clock, game center. Um, you can read books on it if you want to. You can go to you can download music straight from iTunes, just pretty much basic iPhone stuff that's already been around for the last, like, five years now, I guess. Um, of course, we got the App Store and everything else. Um, 
Safari, you can browse and music sounds good. You know, it's got a speaker, built-in speaker, so you can play everything aloud. Um, the, the voice clarity is pretty good when you make phone calls. Um, it's good, but not great. Um, the speakerphone's all right too. I don't know if that's just my connection or anything, but this, um, Verizon, my carrier. Uh, I've had I haven't really had too many issues with it before. Um, they've been pretty good to me. I've got a few drop calls, and but overall my coverage is everywhere that I go is pretty outstanding. Um, but that's about it for the iPhone, you know. I'm glad I finally got one, a smartphone at least, and I'm looking forward to seeing what lies ahead. Apple products are very solid products. I'm, I'm, I'm becoming more of, a, of an Apple fanboy each day. It's kind of scaring me. It's something I used to hate. Not really hate, but like, I don't know, not really like agree with or like by any stretch of the imagination, but now I have like a MacBook and I got an iPhone now. I don't know. Next thing you know, I'll be buying the new iPad that's coming out soon. Or I think it's coming out in a few days, whatever. On the iPad 3, whatever it's called now. But um, let's see, is there anything else in the box? No? The box is nice too, if that's any consolation. I did not get a, um, a protection plan with this. I think it's like $10 extra a month. Um, that's baloney. Just be careful with your phone and it will treat you well back. Um, I guess I'll, I'll show you my case real quick. It's this, um, it's the OtterBox brand. It's the, uh, I think the commuter series. Um, you just kind of like snap it in this outside or this like meshy in interior part. And then you put on like the hard protection part. And it kind of just like snaps on. Oh my god, this this blue one that I like. I, I kinda liked it. But that's that's what it looks like with my case. Um, again it's the Otterbox version. Um, I actually prefer it with it on because the grip feels a lot better. It feels a lot sturdier. I'm not afraid to drop it as much. I can set it down on stuff without worrying. Um, and I got the uh, I got the screen protector on it too. It's not the Invisa Shield one where you like you see the video where like guys like scratched it on the sand or anything like that. It's just like the I think it's like the Verizon brand. It comes with three in the pack I think, and it was only like fifteen dollars. And the other one was like twenty six or twenty seven or something. But yeah, I got this one from the Verizon uh, wireless store. Um, the regular sixteen gigabyte model again, but. Uh, I'm stoked to have it. I'm glad to finally have a better phone, one that I can actually um, get some 3G on and Wi-Fi, which is great. And it's just something great to have. And I recommend smart any type of smartphone if you have a regular phone, because I know what it's been like to be constantly surrounded by people on their iPhones or on their Android. Okay, so this is just some practice video footage on my iPhone. Um, just to see what the quality looks like, but um, my overall thoughts about it, um, it's a nifty little device definitely, um, it's a cool phone, looks cool, works great, but I don't know, it's pretty damn cool, I'm liking it so far, I hope you are, hope the video quality is good because I haven't really looked on it too much, at least on the computer at least, but it should look good, you know, it has a really nice camera in there, but the iPhone 4S, Siri, iCloud, all these amazing features, but no, um, iPhone 4S, good phone, great phone. I'm totally like nerding out right here. It's so amazing. I love my iPhone so much. They are so cool. I cannot wait to get the new iPad. It's gonna be amazing. So I can download all these cool apps on it.